Where we going? The studio. He's bringing his schoolwork. I'm glad that you're not at school so you can join me for this or I'd be all on my own. Yeah. Do you want to unlock it? You can unlock it. The plan is that my desk is going to be right there where crews are sitting. We're going to have to do something with this door because it takes up a lot of room. When you go through here, the power is just about to be turned on, so it's a bit dark. Um, this is going to be where I store everything. So we're going to think of a different way because this is really out of place for me. This way, this is the boys' room. We're going to do something with the sink. We don't need that sink. Mommy. So this is going to be the boys' room. Um, and once that's gone, then they're gonna set up in here. So um, it'll probably also be a storage space once like boxes start arriving, that will go into here. Um, this room is going to be my favorite, I think. So this is where you enter up the stairs. There's a lot of stairs, I'll show you. I'm gonna have to get a runner or something cute. Uh, lots of stairs, but as you enter in here, we're going to put a fake wall over there, block out the kitchen. We'll get like a kettle and a fridge and a microwave and those sorts of things. But over here, I'm going to do um, a nib wall that's pink, light pink, and it's going to have a quote on there of mine. And we're gonna have some pink lounges and coffee table, like a sitting area. And then the kitchenette will be back here, which we will pretty up. And then there's just a toilet back there, which is super handy. Um, when we're going to be here all the time. So that is our space. I'm sharing it with the boys. Cruz's dream is to have his own studio by the time he's 13. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, and he's turning 10 in June. So this will be mine. This will be theirs. And we're just getting the power turned on right now. I love these doors. So we're going to be painting, I think, this wall white, and then there's a nib wall that we're going to put that's going to be pink there. But I love the doors. nearly finished for today so I thought I would show you the progress that Tim has made today on the nip wall so um, obviously this is a commercial lease which means that uh, we are renting the space and so the nip wall that Tim has put in is not uh, a permanent piece it can be removed when we leave uh, I have been working on painting what will end up being where my desk is in the office and uh, then we're going to head home soon after we've done a quick tidy up because the plaster will have to dry overnight and we are ready for a break. All right, Sunday now back into the space. Uh, really lovely to see this room painted white. We just need to get that door off. Um, but we're going to be working on the nib wall today. So that's the goal that we can get, hopefully it painted and the space cleaned up today. This is what we're starting the day with. That's what the nib wall looks like. We need to sand it. Might have to do a second coat of plaster. It's gonna get really messy in here before it gets any better. 
but hopefully by this afternoon we have the wall painted and we can clean up and um, obviously I wait a fortnight then because it's Tim's weekend next weekend. Um, so the only things I can do are things that I can really do by myself. Taking a quick break, thanks to Aloysius. Oh my goodness, this is so delicious and just what I needed this morning. This is avocado under there, avocado and feta on toast. boys Good. got your hot chocolates we're putting the table in tonight so it has arrived so nice, so nice to have a hot chocolate we've got to get daddy's as well so yeah is it nice and warm now this is the room before Ooh. nothing in there this, this could be interesting um <laughs> the table arrived last night but the place it's entered didn't include the screws that we needed so we just did tim tim's fishing but he did a click and collect for me of what i needed so i've just picked that up from bunnings and the boys and i are going to put it together but we just realized we don't have the instructions daddy, so has, daddy has the instructions <laughs> no that's so much no and so you're giving your brother um he doesn't feel well because he doesn't like that sound We're going to break someone's finger or something, so, all right. Let's go. Let's try, don't you just lift it. <laughs> the next thing to go into the office space.
was just to work from a laptop in this space um, because otherwise on a round table cords don't really work but I'm really loving having my desktop here it makes it really easy so I don't know if it's a possibility but I'm gonna have to see if an electrician can put power through where there is a cord that hangs from the roof if that makes sense so people can plug in there um, otherwise what happens is like there, that can't happen. So I've just got to see what I can do, but the rug is here, I love it. The paint tin is there because um, it just needs to straighten out and the chairs are in the mail, they're on their way. Um, and then once I've done that, I just wanna do the gallery wall. So on this wall um, behind where the table is, I'm just wanting to do some um, really cool photos uh, of the ladies that have been a part of our previous year photo shoots so that when I'm sitting here working uh, I can look at actual people and remember my why and remember why it's so important so that's going to be with gold frames on that wall but it's coming together this room is maybe halfway there good morning everyone it is uh, Tuesday today and uh, last night my chairs arrived I had to laugh because it was maybe quarter past eight last night and we were talking about something about the studio at home and Tim was like, oh, I forgot to tell you, your office chairs have arrived. They're in the home theatre. And I couldn't help but laugh to myself because I don't forget those sort of things. If office chairs arrive, I'm so crazy excited. It's like the first thing I tell Tim when he walks in the door is my office chairs have arrived or, you know, a piece of furniture has arrived. Where for Tim, it, the feeling's not mutual. So anyway, about eight o'clock last night, um, we drove over and brought the office chairs into the space so that um, Tim could help me just loading them into the car and that sort of thing. And I'm going to head up to the studio now and show them to you. The chairs are here, the rug is here, the table is here. I think the frames arrive this afternoon and then I have a pink couch on its way as well, which will hopefully be here this week. Um, I'm only really focusing on the front two rooms. So that sunroom and then my actual working space for now. I will have to do a little bit in the kitchenette because ideally having a little bar fridge and a microwave or a kettle would be handy, but it's not necessary right now um so who knows how long that will take but I thought I would take you for a walk up the stairs um, and show you the new office chairs just arrived the pink couch is here and I'm gonna take a break from working on the website to put it together I should just be patient because Tim builds things a thousand times quicker than I ever could but I want to get it done I want the couch to be up so I'm going to here it is they put it down there we had it delivered because I thought it'd be really tricky through the narrow staircase but they just walked it up put it in obviously they're very good at their job so I'm going to take it apart now and build it and then I'm going to have a couch in here, which is very exciting. Gives me options, right? And when people come around um, or the boys come around now, either they sit at the table or they have a couch as well. So let's build this. <laughs> 